I'm sure many will know events like this today don't just happen. We have both been planning this wedding for well over three years now. Third time lucky. Well, when I say we, I actually mean Stevie did all the hard work. She planned the entire day, absolutely everything. Well, apart from the napkins, because I chose those. My name is Mickey, Stevie's father. She calls me Dad. Well, it does in front of me anyway. And if you don't know me, I'm tight. That's it. And tight. Thanks for very willingly giving Stevie away. When I asked if, you, if I could marry Stevie, I never heard anyone say yes so quickly. <laughs> I've got to tell you that you look positively radiant and very regal. And your mum and I are very, very proud of you today. But there's nothing new in that, we've always been proud of you. As I look at this beautiful woman before me in the lovely wedding dress, I can't help but reflect on the girl she was and the woman she has become. She became my girl on the day she was born and who has been a princess to me. And while not every day has been perfect, the love I feel for her has been. Yes. Not a tear yet, not yet. Oh my God. <laughs> Well, enjoy that. Daddy and Very important job. Now look good. Now I'm sure everyone will agree that the maid of honour and bridesmaids all look amazing today. They have done an amazing job of keeping Stevie calm and they actually helped her to make it somewhere on time for once. I'm not going to cry. Beautiful. Say this if any person present knows of any lawful impediment to this marriage, he or she must declare this man, please. Absolute silence. It's a good start. Why do you say that? And you can hold hands, there's no law against you. Today she's joined hands with a wonderful young man. I see a love and joy that beyond anything else I have seen so far. She and Josh have completed each other as they become a new family unit. Do you, Josh, take Stevie to be your lawful wedded wife? I do. Do you, Stevie, take Josh to be your lawful wedded husband? I do. Well, Josh and Stevie have declared that they are free, willing, but for me, more importantly, happy to marry each other. So I'm now going to ask them to turn face each other and hold each of his both hands, please. I, Joshua Smith. Take thee, Stevie Lee Pierce. Take thee, Stevie Lee Pierce. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. Stevie. I, Stevie Lee Pierce. I, Stevie Lee Pierce. Take thee, Joshua Smith. Take thee, Joshua Smith. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. Marriage, as we know, is not always an easy path. It requires devotion, the ability to listen, the strength to put any wrongs right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> Right, where's the young man? What an absolute fabulous job Riley did with the security to start it off. 
He was doing a perfect job to get the proceedings <laughs> moving along. That's it. You're doing a grand that job. Way. You can put it halfway down there. You stay there. That way or that way? Yeah. Uh, and if you can say yeah. these words, please, to Stevie. Stevie, I give you this ring. Stevie, I give you this ring. In the presence of our family and friends. In the presence of our family and friends. As a symbol of our marriage. As a symbol of our marriage. And as a celebration. And as a celebration. Of our love for one another. Of our love for one another. And think around the applause for Ryan. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. So it gives me great pleasure to announce that you are indeed his wife. <laughs> no matter what papers you've signed today, I hope you'll always be my girl. It's truly marvellous to see our family and friends assembled here today, kitted out in your finest and most distinguished wedding outfits. I have to say, you all do brush up very well, the old cliche, but Josh, what a suit. <laughs> yeah, this was immense picking. It is well proud of it. And there's a very special lady in Stevie's life who, who's here today, Margaret. <laughs> who throughout her entire life has been a big influence on the woman Stevie has become today. Margaret, thank you for everything you've done since the day Stevie was born. Josh, it's a huge pleasure to have you in our family. Over the years, if we've come to think of you, the son we never asked for. <laughs> May I say welcome to our family. We know you will make a splendid son-in-law. You clearly love Stevie a lot, and we'll always look after her. And what more could a parent want? Speech, come on, but what I would like to say is we've been friends most of my adult life. I don't think I could have met I am today without one side. The advice, care, and love that this man has shown me over the years is priceless, and I just can't thank you enough, bro. You're very kind, man. Right? The best thing about being a bloke is that this wedding has seemed to have organised itself. But I think we can all agree she's done a fantastic job.
lifetime of love and happiness. To my best friend, I can by Mr. and Mrs. Smith.
sure everyone will agree that you look absolutely stunning today and I feel privileged that you said yeah. Although I don't blame you. Seriously, today I'm so happy I get married to my best friend. We have had the most amazing journey so far. We have done so much in eight, nine years together. We have been on plenty of holidays, had countless laughs together, and we've made lots of great memories. I can't wait to make many more great memories with you.